urban explorers, tunnel rats and graffiti artists. What is the strangest slash scariest thing that you've seen whilst exploring? Former graffiti artist here went with a few mates to paint a spot at around 12 a.m. The spot was an old train repair workshop or something similar, so it was pretty rundown but there were supposedly squatters that lived there from time to time. Little did we know that the squatters who'd been living there previously set up some booby traps, just your usual wood planks with nails sticking up, but the booby trap that stuck out the most was a particularly nasty trap, a trip wire rigged up to a wood plank with about 4 used syringes attached to it, had my mates and I not been looking for booby traps one of us old walked into it. Some people are messed up in the head. I'm a college student in the Philippines. Every day I have to walk in the underpass to go home. My college is just a 10 minute walk from my apartment. Sometimes I call an Uber, but most of the times I like to walk home. One time, it was already almost 12 am that I'm able to go home because I had multiple school works to do with my fellow classmates. My girlfriend offered a ride home, but I insisted on walking. She told me to call her once I reach home. You see, in our country, there are a lot of cases about rape slash murder, you can look it up in Google. I'm not that afraid of walking home alone at 12am, because I'm confident that nothing bad will happen to me, until I came across the underpass, that I pass through every single day, and there were people shouting. They were drunk, smoking cigars, there were also teenage girls tied up and naked, they were also crying. I gasped so loudly, and they turned around and saw me. At this point, I was shaking, and I slowly backed the hell up. While slowly backing up, a man in his 30s grinned at me and counted to 3 and shouts for Puntanakeo, which translates to here I come. So I ran, he was drunk, dirty, and half naked. I didn't care which way I ran, as long as I'm safe. Thankfully, I ran into a street where there are people, and I was shouting for help. The people who helped me were college students too, I think they were drinking alcohol outside their friend's house, they approached me and calmed me down. One of their friends, a girl, offered me a ride home. Bridge inspection. Lots of homeless people. But the weirdest thing was inspecting the underside of a bridge and finding a dildo lying next to a fake leg and guy whose fake leg it was staring at us from the guide rail. I was exploring some abandoned farmhouses on private property and stepped on a 9 inch rusty nail. Definitely lucky I had my tetanus booster, never thought of it being a booby trap, makes sense now, definitely worked, 